Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about application of derivative and an inverse function. So now I will show you how to answer. We need to show that this function has an inverse function. And later that we need to find this one. So now I will show you how to answer. We know that if the function is 1 to 1. So this function has inverse function. So we look carefully about this one. We know that s to the power of 5. This one that is about 1 to 1. This one that is about 1 to 1 function. And this one that is about 1 to 1 function. So because everything that they are 1 to 1 function in here. So we combine together this one that is about 1 to 1. So because they are 1 to 1, so we can say that this function has inverse function. Now the next one we need to find this one. So we see that we want to find first the derivative of inverse function at 120. So because this is about inverse function, so we need to find the value of s for s in here. Now I will put 119 go to the left. And we have number 1 equals to this one. So we know that if we, if we use about the calculator and you got about s equal to number 0. Now if we do first the derivative of inverse function, we have 1 over First, the derivative of original function at s equal to number 0. So we need to do first the derivative of this one. So first the derivative of s to the power, power of 5, we have 5s five to the power of 4. This one, we have 1 over 1 plus s square. This one, we have e to the power of s. This one, that is about the constant. So you got 0. And now we can put number 0 go on here, here, and here. And now we have the final answer. This one we have number 0. This one we have number 1. This one we have number 1 and we have 1 over 2. This is the end. Thank you for watching.